Yeah, wearing the lab coat is just, oh, it feels like getting a hug from a friend you haven't seen in a long time. I swear it's, 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 <laughs> it's something. Uh. Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Cinepress. First off, I want to thank you guys so much for 500 subscribers, but I don't have time to dwell on that today. We have more important business to get to. Today is the day before Thanksgiving, and I am scrolling through the feed as usual a few days ago, and I saw this post recently. Trina Nishimura, the voice of Kurisu in the English dub of Steins Gate, actually has a bit of an issue. Today I'm going to go over the GoFundMe and maybe go over some solutions to how we can help her out. So if you guys will have a little bit of patience with me, I'm going to go check that out right now. So, Justin Holt's leukemia treatment. In early October, our dear friend Justin Holt was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia. He was immediately admitted to the hospital and remains there under a, an aggressive treatment program with the support of his incredibly loving partner and our bestie, Trina Nishimura. Last September, Justin and Trina opened their first business together, Salary Men, an izakaya and ramen shop that the Dallas community quickly embraced. From day one, people were queuing up to an hour in advance of the doors opening in hopes of snagging a seat and some award-winning bites. But in the early summer months, Justin started getting sick. What started as a couple of sick days here and there quickly progressed to sick weeks off. He desperately sought a diagnosis to his symptoms, visiting one doctor or another week after week. Justin has always found joy in serving and helping others. Whether you know him through his participation in charities like Meat Fight, found in Texas Sous Chef Dinner that benefits no, hung no Kid Hungry, serving a free Thanksgiving meal every year to those in need with Freebird, or perhaps you are in the service industry and received a meal during the lockdown with this charity connecting people with plates. It is clear that Justin is always ready to step up and support others, however he can, and now is our opportunity to return his kindness. He needs us. As a community, we can come together and help with the financial burden that lies ahead so that Justin can focus on his health and recovery. Due to the pandemic, Trina is also not allowed to leave the hospital for any reason since it would put her and subsequently Justin at risk of contracting COVID-19. If she did leave, Justin would be forced to finish out his treatment alone. For anyone who has had a loved one go through aggressive cancer treatment, you know that that is not an option. Once they're out of the hospital, Justin still has a long road of treatments ahead. With great sadness, the incredibly tough decision to permanently close Salaryman was made. Justin and Trina's decade-long dream is over, but the shop is just bricks. It's the people who matter. Right now, Justin and his family just need to focus on regaining his health. As friends of Justin, we are asking for assistance on behalf of his family in order to help ease the initial financial burden that over a month long stay in the hospital can bring. Your kind donation will go directly to Justin to help deal with the financial repercussions of his current condition so that he can focus on healing. Thank you all for taking the time to hear Justin's story. Let's be a light in the dark for the thoughtful, generous, and loving man. There is an update here. November 18th, 2020, we wanted to let you know that Justin and Trina are blown away by the overwhelming amount of kindness, generosity, and well wishes from everyone. Times are hard for so many right now. We all feel a bit isolated these days of the pandemic. Having the outpouring of love from the regular friends, community, and even complete strangers has lifted their spirits in ways you cannot imagine. Just knowing they have so much support has provided some much needed healing. Justin is more determined than ever to heal quickly and come back strong to the food community he so loves. We cannot thank you enough for all your donations. The fight is far from over, but we are in a much better start thanks to all of you. Please continue to spread the word and please take care of yourselves. Sending you all so much love. It's been a hard year, as they just said. And I have spent the last week myself having to see friends lose their loved ones too. And I, I just don't want to see that anymore, personally. I, for me, this is a situation where I think if we can help out, then I think we absolutely should. Here's another person who is connected to our community and has shown a lot of support. Her support gave me a huge boost of confidence during the time when I actually felt like I was not going to make it in the acting and entertainment industry. Two years ago when I won the Steins Gate Talent Show, that was a, such a big boost of confidence for me. And Trina Nishimura was actually one of the first people to actually go to my picture when I posted the win on Facebook and she actually liked it. That caught me completely off guard, completely made my day. And I just want to find a small way, if anything, to you know just give back to somebody who's been a voice in our community. And she'll be back as Carisu next year in Phantom Breaker Omnia. I'll cover that at some point. but. It's a lot harder when you have to worry about the health of your loved ones. And I, I have been in those positions too where I've been worried about that before. So any amount that we can provide or if you could at least share this video, that's going to be a big help to the cause. 
there's about 29k left and it's ridiculous to me that you know we live in a country where we still have to really rely on things like GoFundMe to cover health costs. That's another discussion for another time. But until we can fix the overall system, we have to be there for each other and try to help each other in times of need like this. I've always wanted to use my channel to be a force for positive change. So um, if you guys can find it in you to consider uh, donating a little bit, that's already going to be a big help. The link is in the description. I'll put it in the comments as well. Please go ahead and consider checking in there. I want to spotlight this because... I think the Steinsgate community has done some incredible stuff. We have come together many times and we have gone out and shown our support to get the games localized and do so many incredible things. This is a situation where I think just a person needs help, life or death, right? And I wish we weren't in a situation where we have to have people think about the economic burden of their health. But until we can fix the system, then... GoFundMe is definitely a temporary band-aid solution and that's what we can do for right now. So seriously, I know this is Thanksgiving time and I know it's really tight in terms of money for a lot of people, but please consider chipping in. I'm gonna chip in a little bit too tonight and um, just however you guys can help. If you can't uh, spare any change or whatnot, that's completely fine. Feel free to share the video, that's why I made it. So that way more people can catch wind of what we can do here today. And hopefully we can push her over the edge to get her to 100,000, which they need for Justin's treatment. You know, one day, hopefully everything works out, then, you know, I will hopefully be able to go to the restaurant over in Dallas. I think it'd be a fun cover, but right now we've got to focus on Justin's health and hopefully getting him to a good place. At the same time, I'm gonna to try to get a few updates on this situation here. If you wanna consider subscribing to, that'd be fantastic. Uh, I will provide updates as we get more news. If you can find it in you and if you have the extra cash on hand, whatnot, let's all try to chip in a little bit. After all, how can we, the lab members, leave another one of our own in the dust? That's impossible, right? Especially our assistant. She needs our help. And one last thing. If we can get over the $100,000 goal, I will make another Steinsgate song cover. You don't know what it is, but trust that I will put my whole effort to memorize a song and get it done. If you guys want to see that, then uh, let's work towards that goal. Ho hopefully we can do some good here today. I don't always do this sort of stuff on my channel, and uh, I usually keep whatever, um, you know, volunteer charity work private, but I figured that given the spirit of the season and just how much of a year this has been, I, I personally can't stand to see somebody else lose someone that they care about. It is just that harrowing a year and I, I really want this to work out for them. So thank you guys for listening. I know this is a little different. I appreciate your patience and thank you guys so much for 500 subscribers. It's been a great journey. If you guys want to see the continuation of the story, I will provide updates on this, on this channel. Um, so if you want to join in, hit subscribe to No Pressure Though. Other than that, I hope you guys have a great evening yourselves, and I will see you in the next video. Take care. You and I have work to do. I'm so sorry. Stop apologizing. I'm in this mess with you by choice. I'm one of you. Perk up. You're supposedly a world-class mad scientist. One bent on giving the powers that be a little run for their money, right? Of course you are! <laughs> Shut up.